एवरीवन दिस इज अंकित गुप्ता वेलकम बैक इन ज्योग्राफिक ट्रेंच एंड टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस द न्यू इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक ऑफ द टोपो शीट सो आज हम लोग डिस्कस करेंगे न्यू फर्दर टॉपिक्स ऑफ टोपो शीट एंड वी विल डिस्कस फर्स्टली द मेजर कन्वेक्शनल सिंबल्स सो फर्स्ट मेजर कन्वेक्शनल सिंबल इज द लाइन वेल इट इज शोन बाई द ब्लू डॉट्स विच इज प्रेजेंट ऑन द मैप इट रिप्रेजेंट the water present in that region by which we can do the irrigation next convection symbols is the blue dot with 3 r this r represent the depth of the well and how much it it is 3 meter okay so the it represent the 3 r represent depth of the well is 3 meter then blue dot if it is written brackish near the blue dot it represent water is saline which is not fit for drinking next convection symbol this is a black color okay and this represent the dry tank when the black color with this type of lines this represent height of embankment of dry tank is 5 meter this 5 are representing the height of embankment of the dry tank is 5 meter next are the major types of roads these are the major mode of transport also if you see on the map these type of convection symbol you can tell about the answer of that question which is asking that tell the major mode of transport given in map so there are five major types of road first is metal road it represent with red color all types of roads are represent with red color this is unmetal road okay this is car track this is pack track this is footpath these are the five types of road which represent by these convectional symbols and if the this type of number is written near the metal road it represent distance stone many times the question are asked that what is represent this type of number like 20 30 22 it represent distance stone or milestone next this is the black convectional symbol and written is also here bricklin this type of convectional symbol you will find on the map it means it is a place where bricks are baked okay next is lime kiln okay lime kiln means place where the lime stone is purified and lime is made next this black symbol okay it represent survey tree it is a specific tree which we have which has been surveyed next the metal road and stream this is written causeway causeway means the raised metal road across a minor stream next the fire line is written okay this type of convection symbol you will find on the map fire line fire line is that type of region it is a type of wide passage or path where vegetation are fully cleared to prevent from forest fire okay from preventing forest fire people have cleared the vegetation next if you will see the black vertical line on the map like this this is the black vertical line on the map this is not easting these black vertical line represent longitude and these black horizontal line these black horizontal line represent latitudes okay so black vertical line longitude and black horizontal line latitude friends you can see this topographical maps if in this type of map the question are asked that tell the major types of vegetation which is found on this map yeah they can ask they write two types of vegetation which is found in the map so you will have to write this type of name like open mixed jungle dense mixed jungle fairly dense jungle okay and open scrub these are the major type of vegetation which is found on the map many students they write tropical deciduous forest evergreen forest no need to write this type of answer you will have to write open mixed jungle fairly dense jungle these are the major types of vegetation next a common question are asked Uh, like in 2018 2017 2016 15 board examination every year this type of question are asked that if the region in this map extract receive seasonal rainfall 
this map is representing that it is receiving residual rainfall give two reasons for your answer yeah give two evidences for your answer then in these type of evidences if you will see on the map you can write any two or three evidences by which you can explain the it this region is representing seasonal rainfall it may be dry stream dry tank sand dunes dry river broken ground remember friends if that type of conventional symbol is given on that map then you will have to write that name like if sand dunes are not given on that map which you got on the paper then you no need to write the sand dunes on this type of question if the sand dunes is demarcated on this map okay then you will have to write so these type of major evidences which tell the rainfall is seasonal